them a round of applause. Now I know uh, uh, many of you may remember back to June 29, 2005, when I stood not that far from here and made an announcement that we were going to be going ahead with a consolidated courthouse. And I know there was a lot of excitement that day, a lot of it because it was my 40th birthday, but uh, it was also a lot of excitement because uh, the idea of a consolidated courthouse to bring together the various uh, judicial functions and court facilities into a broad, a modern new state-of-the-art facility is something that had been, quite frankly, had been on the books and talked about for many years. And certainly as an MPP, I had heard lots about it and uh, had lobbied, cajoled, and uh, begged down at Queen's Park. It was something that had been discussed for a long, long time, and I think we were all excited on uh, that late June day in 2005 when it became a, uh, a reality. Uh, several years later, again in June, uh, we announced that uh, we were proceeding with it and that we had chosen a site, the site here behind us, the site here where we're standing. And again, there was a lot of excitement, excitement because we were moving ahead with this uh, wonderful project uh, and also because its location here in downtown Kitchener was going to serve to uh, highlight and to add to the downtown uh, intensification and revitalization which is going on here in Kitchener. And of course, as a uh, uh, time when all of us have an eye on the economy, the idea that we would having a, such a large uh, construction project going on here right in our region meant a very important economic stimulus. It meant short-term construction jobs and, of course, a big structure which was going to be uh, uh, the magnet for, for so much. So a lot of excitement in the air. Of course, today is a further chapter in this in terms of the official groundbreaking and a chance to give people a little bit more detail about the courthouse. Um, the facility itself, which will consolidate all our various court facilities here in Waterloo Region, is going to be a state-of-the-art multi-story courthouse with space to accommodate 30 courtrooms and obviously will completely change our downtown area. It will feature a three-story glazed atrium, which will bring natural light deep into the building, a commitment to meet leadership in energy and environmental design, LEED Silver Standard, and the building design will emphasize energy efficiency, a high quality and healthy indoor environment, and reduce greenhouse gas emissions. And it features a contemporary design providing a new civic plaza in the heart of downtown Kitchener. And I should also stress that uh, the design and the construction will have a very close eye on making it accessible and meeting the new standards for the Ontarians with Disabilities Act. So we're very, very proud to have this uh, new facility here in downtown uh, Kitchener, which is going to serve the region and has been a very, very long time in coming. It's been a long time in coming. When I look around the room, I think everyone around the tent, I think a lot of folks will agree. And that brings me to the guests that we've gathered here today to help celebrate this, people who have been part of the uh, long journey leading to a new courthouse. I begin, of course, and we'll be calling on him to speak in a few moments with our Attorney General, Chris Bentley, who is here uh, uh, to, to speak about the courthouse. We're also joined by our colleague Elizabeth Whitmer, the MPP for Kitchener-Waterloo. I have to bring uh, the very sincere regrets of uh, our colleague Leanna Pendergast, the MPP for Kitchener-Conestoga, who couldn't be with us this morning, but sends her best wishes on this very important occasion. We're also joined by uh, a number of municipal politicians, Chair Ken Sealing, uh, Mayor Carl Zare, uh, Regional Councillors Bill Strauss and uh, Tom Galloway and Jean Hallbloom. I see former Member of Parliament uh, Karen Redmond. And of course, beyond the elected politicians, we of course have so many people here from uh, uh, the legal community. We have uh, uh, judges who are here, individuals who uh, have been waiting a long time for this day. So I'm so pleased that we could gather the community together on this very wet morning to, uh, as I say, celebrate a very, very important chapter. Uh, the courthouse's mandate, of course, is to serve all of Waterloo Region and consolidate all the uh, functions under one roof. And uh, in that spirit, or to speak on behalf of the municipality, I'd like to call on Regional Chair Ken Sealing to say a few words, okay? 